our video for today is about doon sa mga nag-viral na math problem. So, ito ay isa sa mga nag-viral na math problem. Actually, this one is under order of operation or the PEMDAS. Sa PEMDAS, minsan marami tayong nagkakamali in how to solve this kind of problem. So, for now, let us have a review about PEMDAS before we proceed. So, okay. So, before we start, we have to review first about PEMDAS. So, PEMDAS is an acronym for P is for parenthesis. E is for exponent. M is for multiplication. And D is for division. A is for addition. And S is for subtraction. So, in solving PEMDAS, we have to follow rules. Okay, so, we have here, naglagay ako ng araw dito para tandaan natin na ang pag ng PEMDAS, we have to start from left to right. Okay? So, again, P is for parenthesis, E is for exponent, M is for multiplication, D is for division, A is for addition, and S is for subtraction. So, ang ibig sabihin nito ay unahin natin isolve yung number na nasa parenthesis or number inside the parenthesis. And then, next is the number that has an exponent. And then, multiplication then division, addition, and subtraction. Pero, uh, si multiplication at saka si division, it doesn't mean na nauna si multiplication, unahin natin, natin siya isolve. Si multiplication at saka division ay pareho lang sila. So, whichever come first, kung sino, sino yung nauna sa kanila, may, yun yung unahin natin na isolve. And then, we also have addition and subtraction. Ganun na din kung sino yung nauna sa kanilang dalawa, yun ang unahin natin isolve. So, let us start to solve the viral uh, math problem. So, we have here the problem 6 divided by 2. So, meron tayong parenthesis dito. And then, inside the parenthesis, uh, 1 plus 2 equals n. So, alam naman natin yun si n represent the answer. Okay? So, again, we have to solve now, we have to go back to our guide. So, ano nga bang unahin natin isolve? Yung number na nasa loob ng P or parenthesis. So, sa problem na ito, ano nga bang number na nasa loob ng parenthesis? Okay, that's correct. We have here 1 plus 2. Now, to solve this problem, we have to copy first. Kopyahin muna natin si 6 divided by 2. Kasi hindi muna natin siya sasagutin. Okay? And then we have to answer the number inside the parenthesis, which is 1 plus 2. 1 plus 2 equals 3. Okay? So, so that's it. And then, ano isusunod natin? So, next is we have here, 6 divided by 2. Again, we have to go back our guide. We have here, parenthesis. Next is exponent. Meron bang exponent ang problem natin? So, Wala. Then, we have to proceed to either multiplication or division, whichever come first. So, sa problem na ito, ang nauna ay ang division. Okay. But before that, nakikita nyo ba ito? So, wala tayong makikita ang multiplication sign dito. Pero, pagka makita nyo yung parenthesis na ganito, ibig sabihin, we have to multiply 3. Yun sa result ng ni 6 divided by 2. Okay. So, again, Tapos na tayo ni parenthesis. Then, we have to... Uh, next is exponent. Pero, walang exponent dun sa problem natin. So, si multiplication or si division. Kung sinong nauna sa kanilang dalawa. Kaya na din ni addition at saka ni subtraction. Okay? So, we have to answer. 6 divided by 2 equals 3. Then, 3 multiplied by 3. So... N is equals to, the answer is, 3 times 3 equals. So, ano pa nga ba yung mga number na nag-viral? Okay, we have here, 8 divided by 2, parenthesis, uh, open parenthesis, then 2 plus 2, 
close parenthesis equals. Okay. So, we again, we have to answer this problem. So, to answer this, again, we have to follow our guide. So, uunahin natin sagutan yung number na nasa loob ng parenthesis. So, we have to copy 8 divided by 2. And then, we have to answer 2 plus 2. 2 plus 2 equals 4. So, next is we have to divide 8 by 2. Oh, I'm sorry. We have to check our rules first. Okay. Next is number that has an exponent. So, meron bang exponent dun sa mga number? Well, so, ang susunod ay yung multiplication. Okay. Or division. So, sa kanilang dalawa, again, ang nauna ay si division. So, we have to answer divide first. So, 8 divided by 2 equals 4. 4 times 4. Okay. So, N is equals to 4 times 4 equals 16. So, 16 is our answer. So, nakuha nyo ba? So, ngayon naman ay susubok tayo ng ibang problem yung my exponent. So, now let us try 3 times uh, 3 plus 7 minus 3. 2 cube divided by 2. Okay, so in this problem, we have multiplication, we also have parentheses, and then we also have subtraction and the exponent and divide. So, let's try to answer this one. But before that, we have to check our rules. Again, we have to answer first the number inside the parenthesis. So, sa problem natin ito, yung number na nasa parenthesis natin ay yung 3 plus 7. So, we have to copy first 3 times kasi mamaya na natin yan sagutan. So, we have to answer 3 plus 7 equals 10. Minus, okay, minus sa, okay, para hindi kayo malito. So, unahin lang muna natin ang sagutan yung number na nasa loob ng parenthesis. So, kopyahin muna natin to 2 cube divided by 2. So, next, we have here 3 times 10 minus 2 cube divided by 2. So, next, after parenthesis, yung isusunod naman natin ay yung number na may exponent. So, alin dito ang may exponent? Si 2. 2 cube. So, ko Kopyahin natin si 3. 3 times 10 minus 2 cube. Oh. So, how to solve 2 cubes? So, to solve that one, hindi mo i-multiply si 2 by 3. Again, 2 cube. You have to multiply 2 by itself 3 times. Okay? So, we have to multiply 2 times 2 times 2 equals. Ano nga bang sagot? Okay, 2 times 2 equals 4. Times 2, so 2 times 2 equals 4, times 2 equals 8. So, 2 cubes is equals to 8, divided by 2. So, we, we copy divided by 2 kasi ang sinagutan muna natin ay yung number na may exponent. So, we're done with the parenthesis and then we are also done with the exponent. So, ang isunod-sunod naman natin ay si either multiplication or division, whichever come first. So, sa problem natin ito, ang nauna ay si multiplication. So, we have to answer multiplication. So, 3 times 10 equals 30 minus 8 divided by 2. So, 8 divided by 2 is equals to 4. Okay? So, n is equals to, again, so n is the answer. So, n is equals to 30 minus 4. So, 30 minus 4 is equals to 26. So, 26 is our final answer. Nakuha nyo ba? So, yan lang muna sa ngayon. Gagawa tayo ng part 2 niyan para mas maintindihan nyo ang PEMDAS. Thank you for watching.